Hey, welcome to Quick Bites, where we bring you tech, science, and entertainment news quick, fast, and swiftly. My name is Evan, let's dive in. Solar power is a big deal. It is perhaps the most reliable form of clean, renewable energy that has the potential of solving all kinds of environmental issues around the world. And what's even better is that it is becoming cheaper and more efficient. It's completely possible that one day entire cities can be powered using only solar panels. However, there are some complications with this. Solar panels would need to be placed in areas where sunlight hits them the most. But unfortunately, architects like to reserve that area for windows so sunlight can shine through the buildings. But what if solar panels and windows were the same thing? Well, back in August of 2014, researchers at Michigan State University created the first fully transparent solar concentrator. Essentially, this is a clear pane of glass that collects energy from the sun, which can be gathered by solar cells and converted into electrical energy. Real quick, this video is sponsored by Savant, introducing the next generation of lighting control and energy automation. Check them out at savant.com. Solar panels today use dark sheets of silicon crystals to absorb sun rays and convert them into electrical energy. But the problem is they're dark and not transparent at all. Transparent solar panels are essentially a pane of glass that contain a very thin layer of tiny silicon particles called quantum dots that only absorb small wavelengths of sunlight while allowing larger wavelengths to pass through. These quantum dots then emit the energy into small solar cells, which then converts it into electrical energy. The transparent solar concentrators can be used as windows in buildings, allowing sunlight to shine through them while providing power for the entire building. These solar panels aren't 100% transparent, but neither are typical building windows. This means that from a design standpoint, this is a wonderful option for providing solar-powered energy for buildings. However, at the moment, transparent solar panels aren't nearly as efficient as regular solar panels, so there is a lot of work to be done before they can actually be used. But with how much research that's going into these transparent solar panels, it's not unreasonable to say we will start seeing them in buildings within the next decade or so. So what do you think of transparent solar panels, and how else can they be used? Let us know in the comments below.